Erica, good afternoon. And of course, DCF had some involvement in the case of little Jack Lloyd Cell, but that wasn't the focus today. The main focus was another face in the case of a little boy who almost died. Alexandra Chadwick, a mother of two, entering her plea to charges, she was complicit in the abuse and neglect of another child. Her boyfriend's son, a little boy, hurt so bad he ended up in a coma. Charges are very serious, and um, she's concerned. Um, she's concerned, obviously, for all of the children that she uh, is involved with. According to police, seven year old Jack Loisel was in grave condition when they showed up at his home in Hardwick over the summer, beaten, burned, and starved down to just 38 pounds. His own father, Randall Lintz, is already in custody. He was arrested back in July, now being held on $200,000 cash bail. It's a case that an internal DCF review blamed on a systemic failure within the agency. And as they work to right those wrongs, Chadwick now faces the same bail. She's looking forward to working with me on this case, and hopefully we can come to a satisfactory result. And DCF was involved once again because of Chadwick's two children. They both are in DCF care right now. Again, being held on bail pending another court appearance on October 21st. Log in Worcester this noon. I'm Jim Loke, WCBB, New Center 5.